Hello traders, welcome to freetradingvideos.com where the traders are smart and education is free. Wow, what a ride we had on research in motion today. Anyway, I just wanted to review it technically using candlestick charting. And what we have here is a two month chart, research in motion, each candlestick is a day. Now, the thing I want to look at here is um, this big down this big down day that we received today which is over eight points um, and it, we sustained a pretty good hit uh, we had a company the research analyst over at Piper and Jeffrey uh, downgraded some numbers and it gave us every excuse in the world to be able to sell some REM today anyway let's take a look at this if we go back in time here in October we had what's called a rising wedge formation very bearish formation and we had a break this day and you could have caught a short if you were here watching it when it dropped around uh, 128 dollars there you would have shorted it made a good chunk of change and then we have what's called a dead cat bounce and we bounce up here and then we drop double bottom formation which is a bullish formation and then we rally now here's the problem we have a lower swing high that is a bearish setup it's a bearish formation you don't like that what I don't like also is that we pierced the 20 day moving average I don't like that we close below that very bearish and we did a touch and go on the 50 day this is the red line that I have here this is the 50 day moving average it touched it shot right back up but look at this monstrous volume huge volume coming down now Things in motion tend to stay in motion. This is a big down day. Chances are it will be followed with more down days. Now, if it pierces the 50 day, we're in trouble. Now, check this out. Um, usually, when we have a cross on the MACD at the top, we get a drop in price action. Here, we have a cross, and, and it drops down. Price action drops down. We come here, we cross and drop down big drop in price action here we drop we're crossing over and we're starting for a drop so the question is, is how long will this drop go one thing you can do is pull up a Fibonacci retracement and just go down to the bottom part and drag it up to the top part here and um, isn't it interesting that we stopped right at the point 382 Fibonacci retracement area and uh, if we pierce this to uh, Monday the 50 day moving average and the 0.5 area the halfway mark on the Fib uh, Fibonacci retracement uh, this thing is in big time trouble it's hard telling where to go but when you have this big of a drop with this much gas behind it I, ex I expect plenty of follow through anyway a couple other things here um, this green line, which happens to be at a nice whole round number, $125, was resistance here. Came down, look, we stopped acting as support. It doesn't surprise me that we came up and hit our head and dropped there. That shouldn't have surprised anybody. Now, let's look at this even closer. Look how this candlestick gapped up. We had a gap first thing this morning. See how we gapped up right there? that's usually a very bad sign now look at this here it gapped up see how it gapped up there look what happened the very next day big down day let's just look back see if there's any others that I can find I'm just going I'm just dragging the chart going back in time and um, yeah see this we have a gap up and a red can it's a gap up with a red candle and then we drop let's go back right here we have a gap up there's a red candle drop Yep, so there, um, when you see these, they're telltale signs that bad things are to come. And you can go back and keep watching those. So we have a gap up. Here's our red candle. Bad things sh you know, are to come. <laughs> so anyway, listen, guys, don't get suckered into this. A lot of people say this is a great buying opportunity for this company. Stock prices drop for a reason. 
you're at this price for good reason. Only buy things going up, not going down. That's a sucker's play. It's an amateur move. Think professionally. If you're going to buy a company long, you want it going in the right direction. So make sure you're playing a, a, a setup that's, that's prone to be bullish that is going to go in your favor. If you're not sure what you're looking at, go into our chart school, figure it out, watch it, and know how to trade. Know how to trade like a professional, watch the charts, and be proficient at those. So anyway, happy trading to you out there. Good luck in the markets.